Hey, I'm Sean Stubbs. You might know me as Disaster, Munchies for You, or TZ and Predator. This week, I'm here to talk to you about how to play a 1v1 sniper match on Gears of War. Forget the number two, because number two is newbie. Right, the first rule is we don't hard aim, okay guys? It's a very important rule. LT. We only use that for the final second when we've already lined the shot up. Now to line the shot up is the fourth rule. I'll talk to you about that in a minute. The second rule is this button here. The B button is newbie, okay? We don't touch this button. That is for chainsaw wielding noobs like George Barnes, okay? We just don't press this button. I don't know why it's there. Okay? Right, the third rule, quite an important rule, is that you can never lose. Say so, say so you get your head blown to fucking pieces, you come up with an excuse. Now there's three excuses. The first one is you're eating your dinner and you're only playing one handed. The second one is that your mum caught you wanking over your Gears of War case. And the third one, I don't use the third one a lot. Ah, oh, that's it. They get you from behind. That's just such a cheap shot. You have to tell them they're a dirty little scrub for getting you from behind. It's so cheap. It's ridiculous. People like LFC Killer do that to me, and I hate it so much. Right. Now our fourth rule. <coughs> Excuse me. This is so important. The fourth rule. This is how we aim. Do all you people out there know what this is? It's blue tack, right? The only way to get a good headshot, from my point of view, is to put a piece of blue tack in the middle of the screen. If you go, it's got to go right in the middle, and it will line their head up perfectly. Okay? It's such a fantastic invention. Okay? Whoever invented blue tack is a genius. Uh, that's that's my four rules on how to play a one v one sniping match. Now, if you excuse me. I need to have a wank.